look at the maps here. We're going to start in Collier County and work our way around Goodland, Everglades City, Oak, uh, choppy anywhere from 52 to 54 degrees and we've got 40s now from Orange Tree, Sunnyland all the way up through Immokalee as we get a little closer to the river there uh, near the uh, Fort Myers area we're at 51 so uh, everyone's sitting a little bit below our average of 56 and those 40s also extend out between Alva and Lehigh Acres. Right now DeSoto County, Hall, Brownville, Arcadia all around 50 upper 40s there from Rotunda, El Jobin. It gets a little warmer towards Venice and Osprey this morning uh, but we're all a little chilly especially for our standards. You'll need that jacket here early. 49 there at Hall City and Palmdale. And compared to where we were yesterday, it's a five degree drop around the lake and inland along State Road 29, it's a seven uh, degree decrease. So definitely a little cooler. That breeze out of the north yesterday really ushered in some dry and cool air. And you can see the dew point values in the low to mid 40s. The wind is out of the north. It's 10 to 12 miles per hour right now. And we will see it gust just a little bit today. Matter of fact, those wind gusts will pick up 15 to 18 miles per hour unlike yesterday where we saw them up around 30. So you can see the uh, numbers here throughout lunchtime, 10 to 12, and then we get those gusts on top of us. So nice little breeze coming in out of the northeast, keeping things nice and quiet. This is what it looks like uh, for the afternoon. Notice there's barely a cloud in sight, let alone rain. We're out until 2 to 6 where we see a few clouds try to make their way over to southwest Florida, and they're going to be few and far between. So the Almanac shows the highs and the records. 86 is our record high. 77 is the average. Well, this afternoon we're going to be below that. We'll go up to about 73 degrees and then overnight tonight still chilly, but not quite as cold. We'll be in the low 50s as we got another nice night on the way. Looking uh, long term here, that area of low pressure kind of becoming elongated and the flow around it is still picking up enough moisture over the Gulf Stream to provide some showers there around Bimini, but they're staying off the uh, southwest water coastline and most of the east coast as well. So as we go through the next couple of days, the wind today is northeast, but tomorrow a little more easterly and that will continue here on Friday as well. That's a warmer weather pattern for us. We'll see partly cloudy skies and our humidity will start to come up and our temperatures will be in the upper 70s here Thursday and Friday. Now looking long term with that low pulling away ridge of high pressure builds in that's going to keep us warm and quiet but next Monday and Tuesday we'll see another dip in the jet stream that will bring us a shot of rain early on Tuesday. Right now it looks to be the early morning hours on Tuesday with a little bit of a cool down but definitely breezy as well. Our forecast today out on the water has the winds out of the north 10 to 15. No advisory. So these two to four, so they're coming down. Check the water temperature this morning. It was at 69.9 degrees out at Fort Myers Beach. Let's get you over to the seven day because uh, the warm up is going to continue right through the weekend. Matter of fact, we'll be in the upper 70s near 80 for Sunday and Monday, and then slightly cooler there on Tuesday as we see that chance of rain early on Tuesday morning.